Yo, give me five. I want to talk to you guys about goals and your whys to those goals. Because a lot of people want certain things, right? They set their goals. And then when times get really hard, they quit or they fall back. And it's mainly because their why really isn't that strong. So, you know, at Orange Street Fitness, you know, you ask someone, what's your goal? Well, I wanna lose 12, 15 pounds. My immediate question is why, right? Like, well, why? Why 12 to 15? Why not 20, 25? Why not five? Why that number, right? Um, and then, you know, you'll get answers kind of, well, that's what I used to win in high school and things like that. I'm like, okay. The journey to, let's say, if you're trying to lose weight, for example, right? You have to find out your macros, carbs, proteins, fats, right? You have to find your metab basal metab metabolic rate, right? So let's say to just keep what you have, you have to eat 1,700 calories, for example, without exercising, without doing anything. You need 1,700 calories to sustain what you have. Right, so now you wanna lose weight, so you're gonna to have to cut some calories, right? So let's say you cut 500, so now you're down to 1200. It's important to track your food, right? So MyFitnessPal, there are other apps you can use, but when you set a goal, when you write it down, and you're like, this is what I want, right? It seems, not to say easy enough, but it's, you know, at the beginning, you're you're going, you're strong, you know, motivation is high, and then, you know, you get to a point where maybe your weight loss kind of stops, right? You kind of plateau, and you start to question yourself, like, well, should I be doing this, should I be not? It's very important that, like, your why, why you're doing it is stronger than the goal. So, you know, let's say when your why is you want to lose 15 pounds for a wedding because you want to look good for your spouse, your why should be stronger than your goal because it's going to drive you to lose that 15 pounds because you really want to look nice for your significant other on your wedding day. So that's going to carry you through those tough times, right? It's not looking good. It's not weighing a certain weight that's gonna get you through those tough times. It will not. It's your why. It's what will carry you through. Some people's whys are, you know, family members or friends or someone who's passed away or someone they look up to. Whatever your why is, make sure that why is stronger than your goal because you need that why. Because when it gets hard, you're gonna hit that wall and you're gonna look for motivation, you're gonna look for external motivation, but if that internal motivation, that internal why is not strong, motivation will be fleeting because it, it's not as meaningful. It, doesn't, it, it will not get you out of bed at the hour you need to get up at because it's not strong enough. So I already told all of you, like my motivation is my grandma, right? So she makes me never wanna quit whether I'm running, whether I'm working out, whether I'm coaching, whether I'm trying to get better at something in my life, like she's always in my ear. And uh, yeah, I just, I know I need to be better and do better. So whenever I'm not feeling it, you know, that's my why. She's my why and I get up, I show up and I do the best I can every single day. So before you set a goal, really think about why? Why do you want to lose weight or why do you want to, let's say, like some people want to gain weight or gain muscle? Why? And it, the answer cannot be, oh, because I want to look good or because I want to be stronger or I want to be toned. That can't be your reason. That is not a strong enough reason. Like it will not work. And if it does work, great, but it will not fulfill you. So your reason has to be huge. It's gotta be almost outside of you to be powerful enough to pull you. 
because trust me, like you need something that pulls you instead of pushing you. Because whatever pulls you is gonna pull you during the hard times. During the hard times, it's very hard to be pushed, okay? So find your why, really narrow it down and pinpoint it. Once you find that, you're free.